What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ Prospect Profile. Today we're focusing on Calgary Flames prospect Mark Jankowski, a kid I was critical of our Calgary drafting due to um, you know, the kid's got a high upside. He played Canadian high school puck, um, and it will be a problem next year for Stansted College, which is in college in Canada, the first college, more for high school. Um, you know, I think Calgary is one of the most depleted, awful, got atrocious farm systems in uh, all hockey. And this kid's got high upside, but I think there's a lot of risk in taking him. Meaning the highest level competition he's played against has been Canadian high school hockey. Um, I know he will be the uh, first line center to start this year. Prop he's supposed to go to Dubuque this year of uh, the USHL, but he's going to Province. You know, long, lanky center. You know, got Jason Spets in comparisons, I've heard. Um, you know, good playmaker. He was undersized until like two years ago at a major growth spurt. And he's off 6'2", 175, it's like 5'8", you know, three years ago. So you look at just how much bigger he's gotten. He had 97 points in 57 games for Stan said last year. And, you know, obviously, but how good is that competition? You know, he's going to need at least three years of Providence, at least. And, uh, you know, it's good to get him started this year in September. I think he will be on my Hockey East All Rookie team. I think he'll do well there. I just don't think, I think that... He has the bus potential. I'm not. I'm rooting for the kid. You know, I'm not. I'm not wishing to fail at all. But I mean, I think you know, someone tweeted me. Well, you know, Vancouver and New Jersey. I'm on the draft board. Yeah, but Vancouver and New Jersey are both good teams that have pretty good farm systems. Calgary isn't. You know, I think they're putting too much onus on this kid. I think he's a highly skilled player. But I also think there's a lot of downside there. We have not seen this kid play against a high level competition. How is he going to fare? I think he's going to do well. I mean, I'm picking him to do well. But I think the the jury is out on what whether or not he will. Um, I, like I said, my gun thinks he'll do all right, but there's still a lot of doubters out there that say, look, I mean, this this kid, you know, he's going from Canadian high school hockey to Hockey East, which is, you know, one of the dominant conferences in college hockey. You know, the, you know they've won, uh, you know, four out of the last five national championships, if any of the BC or BU, so it's, let's look at it that way. But, um, you know, like I said, I'm rooting for the kid. I think he's a, he can definitely be a shot in the arm for Calgary in four or five years and be a big part of the rebuilding process. But I also think, I mean, you know what's what's going on here um you know with taking a kid with such a, a real low ceiling a real low like um floor you know so to speak he's got a high ceiling but a low floor he's got uh he's gonna go one way or the other uh, and um you know i'm curious to watch his phone i'm rooting for him like i said i think he'll do well at providence i think hopefully that and that's a program that could really use some success uh they've been short on it recently and i think Landing a high-end recruit like this kid will be a big step in them taking the leaps forward in not uh, competing in hockey. He had a pretty good run last year. Providence did losing a Lowell in the hockey East, uh, semifinals. No, they beat Lowell and lost to BC. So uh, hopefully this kid gives him a shot in the arm. Like I said, big skilled pivot. You know the the Spezza Joe Thornton comparisons. I guess they're out there. But I uh, will see how it all how, how it all works out the kid. Uh, that's all I got this episode of the Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles on Calgary Flames Prospect Mark Jankowski. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the offseason and beyond. Later, guys.